hands at Chimaev just came on the scene and almost steamrolled the people that were put in front of him. First, he made his debut against John Phillips in a one-sided beating. Submission. After that, he fought Reese McKee. It's another win for Hamzat Chimaev. He is a wrecking ball. Wow. Your winner by TKO and still undefeated, Hamzat Boz Chimaev. Where is the ceiling for you? Where is your limit? I'm going to smash everybody. His next test came against veteran Gerald Mearshaw. I feel like uh, Hamzat's looking past me a little bit, but again, I'm a tough guy and I'm going to show him that this time you get off more than you can chew. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mark Smith has called a stop to this contest. Oh, oh, so oh, 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 just like that! Oh, oh, you oh, One and done! He kept telling me leading up to this fight, you think I'm a wrestler, wait till you see my hands. Holy <laughs> He wasn't lying. Everybody, I come here for everybody. Kill everybody. That is it. Ten and all. The hype is real. Ah! Comes out Shimaya. Looks to prove the world that he is very much the real deal. Oh! oh wow. Straight right hand drop burns. Oh! Now he's like that. He's got it. He's got it. What a fight. Comes out Shimaya and Gilbert Burns go the full fifth. The winner, and still undefeated, this is UFC 279. Oh, good is wow. he? Uh, so everything you need to know here about Paulo Costa, he is the number seventh ranked middleweight. He's got 11 knockouts, one submission. Let's start first with the fact that Paulo Costa uh, did not have an amateur debut. He went straight to the pros in February of 2012, made his UFC debut in March of 2017 against Gareth McClellan. Costa comes out throwing guns straight he's away. He's dangerous, like, man. He's wild straight Costa's away. Costa's very, very, very dangerous. McClellan's right here. Here goes McClellan. Paulo Bojacinha. And what a way to make an impression on UFC fans around the world. On the short list of the scariest knockout artists in the UFC at present, enter Paolo Costa. How many middleweights survive that Paolo Costa power and authority? You told me this week, you're not just ready to be in the UFC, but you're ready to face top 10 talent right now. I think I'm ready for a top 10 fighter after this performance. There's not a specific name that I can mention. Costa, he's full throttle from the opening bell, right? Look at Costa, the young guy, not just headhunt here. Oh, that's it, that's it. Whoa! Paolo Costa does it again. to show for the, to the world who I am. But now is a new time. I am representing a new generation from Brazil and I will, be, I will be the next legend from Brazil in UFC. <laughs> oh! He clips her! He's hurt. <laughs> oh! Oh my goodness! What a fight. Costa and Yoel Romero go the 15 minute distance. This is UFC 278. Ball the Eraser! Oh. What the fuck? You can't hide from me. You can't hide from me. I'm here to announce that the card that everyone has been waiting for, we got it done. Abu Dhabi, UFC 294 on Saturday, October 21st. Also on the card, the guy everybody's been waiting to hear about, Hamzat Shamayev returns, and he will be facing Paulo Costa. Shamayev is 12-0, 11 finishes, and he's coming off a dominant first round submission of Kevin Holland. Costa has an 86% finish rate, and let me just say this, he and Shamayev do not like each other. This should be one hell of a fight. I really like this fight. I remember it being announced and yeah. thinking, oh, violence. The co-main event with Paulo Costa and Hamzat Shamayev should be a difficult fight for both guys. The, the, the danger with Costa is always that bulldozer coming forward with raw power. 
every single one of these guys in the division could get knocked out cold by Paolo Costa. Costa's got his problems, but when it comes time to be a dog, you don't really have to worry about him. Tom Zachibayev is the best prospect I've ever seen in MMA, essentially. I mean, this guy has just burst onto the scene, maybe the star of Fight Island. He's a finisher. Like, he goes for the finish. He's not like one of these, you know, wrestlers who just wants to lay on you. He is going to kill you. He is going to <laughs> maul you like a wolf. The guy's special. I've been in this game my whole life. I've never seen anything like him. Because if you look what he has done since he's came to the UFC, it's been nothing short of incredible. Costa, he's full throttle from the opening bell, right? Costa comes out throwing guns straight He's away. dangerous, like, man. He's wild Costa's away. very, very, very dangerous. He's got outstanding striking. He's got real power. And he's fast. He's fast and powerful. Now, Paulo Costa, like I said, power puncher, big, big puncher. He traps opponents. He loves doing that. He's super pressuring. Make that guy cry, you know, in the cage. <laughs> You're gonna make him cry? Yeah. <laughs> Shimae, you need to do something, motherfucker. I still, I stole everything that you had. Paulo Costa will move forward. He's gonna throw big shots. He will not stop punching. You have these two incredibly talented savages. That fight should be ridiculous. Only one way to find out. You will face a monster. I will strike. Let's see who is the real guy. Kill everybody! Ah! Love these kind of fights when you have two of the baddest dudes in the world. This should be one hell of a fight. Hamza Chumayev, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the most dangerous guy here. I got a comment for everyone. Hello, white boy. Paulo Costa, ladies and gentlemen. I just come in here, take my belt. I am their champion. It it's finally here. This is a big moment for the middleweight division. Oh!